Now, how does stress, anxiety, and depression cause high blood pressure? Now, start with stress. Nowadays, there are many things that you can be stressed about. You can stress about your work. You can stress about things that happen around the house. You can stress about having to pay bills, paying the mortgage, feeding your family. You can get stressed about your health. You can get stressed about any bad things that happen around your neighborhood or around the world. And if you really want to be stressed, there are millions of things that you can get stressed about. And what's wrong with being stressed? Now, when you are stressed, your body interprets that as an emergency situation and it will prepare yourself for it. So, the sympathetic nervous system will be activated and that means that your heart rate will goes up, the heart will be beating harder, your blood vessels might constrict and you will have higher blood pressure. And how long are you normally stressed for every day? Now, now, back to the example where you were being chased by the lion that only happened for about maybe 5 minutes. If you are only stressed for 5 minutes every day, then that is not stress. Some of you might have a feeling of being stressed for hours and hours every day. That means that your blood pressure will remain elevated for hours and hours every day. What if the stress that you have remain for days and weeks, months, years, then your blood pressure will remain elevated and it would gradually worsen.